Good afternoon, everyone. Thank you so much for setting aside some time for public comment. Uh, I have had the pleasure of working with public advocates in the Six Winds Network this summer, and that included going to all four of the community engagement meetings, which were, I can't stress enough, remarkable. Um, there were over 150 community members who showed up on Monday nights after work, after summer camp, um, and we captured photos. We tried to bring those voices um, into this space as best we could, synthesizing that in some of the documents. Um, but the visual was powerful, and being in that space was very important to me in conceptualizing the potential of the CASA process, and also who any one of us who is working on this effort is accountable to. Um, so I made a similar request last week of the technical committee, and I would make it of you as well, is to grab one of these packets. It's um, the set of photos that we took, set of slides, and hold on to it throughout this process. Um, these are the constituents of the Bay County, uh, or the Bay Area, who, who are going to most directly feel the impact of whatever comes out of this. And I just want to bring one voice into this space, if I can, because I hope that she is off enjoying the summer somewhere and outside playing before school starts. But the very last slide is a girl. Um, her name's Diana. She is probably in middle school, maybe, probably elementary school. And she came out uh, for our last meeting. She's part of the um, Youth United for Community Action organization in East Palo Alto that we were working with. And the picture that you'll see, the last one in the packet, is her representing her entire small breakout group, uh, elevating the priorities that they emphasized. I think rent control was the very first one um, that they mentioned. And her and her peers had also done a survey of fellow students, I think over 110 students who have been experiencing the effects of an affordability crisis and who at least almost 20 of them, maybe more, um, have experienced eviction, have been displaced. And I hope that you all will remember these folks and will think of Diana and the fact that hopefully she'll be in your seat in 2040. But until then, this was her platform. Um, and I hope that we can give her voice in this process. Thank you. Thank you.